message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! Malaka! The Cyclops said you like to act tough, so act tough! Get a little closer. Thank you. No the Cyclops always does stick. You have a lesson, Papa. If the Cyclops wants to teach me, tell him to come here himself. <laughs> Last week? This shit happens every week. I can't keep doing this. Nah. Thanks for the warning. Oh. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. Hungry to eat with us? <laughs> Do you think Zeus would bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Cassandra? Maybe you could ask him for me. Phoebe? We've been over this. I know, I know. He's just an ego. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. What does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. What? A vineyard? Malaka. It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me drachmi, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. Where can I find Marcus's new beautiful estate? You know the statue of Zeus on Mount Ainos? It's south of that. Well, I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. I'll go tell Marcos you're coming. Go, go! My head! Fun's over. Tell that one-eyed freak if he ever sends you here again, I'm gonna cut out his other eye and feed it to my belt.
guess this is the vineyard. Straight ahead. There you are. Let's see what you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos.
I keep telling you, you, you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Cassandra, thank the gods. Phoebe found you in time about grapes. I can still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's beside the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine? I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. <laughs> is that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. All right. And do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Uh, of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sami. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sammy, my friend. Who's the merchant? Zuris. You know Zuris. He's very nice. Zuris? Again? Why do you keep lending him money? He's a loyal friend. I don't want his family to starve. You're a good friend, but you're bad with money. He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot, too long a walk to go on foot. But think of it as interest, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. The one in the middle. Tell me about it. Ah, you have picked a beauty, my friend. That horse is from Thessalonia. Bread for its courage. Tell me about this one. The Skiros. You have an eye for sturdy stock, my friend. That horse can cling to mountain passes like a goat. Huh. I like the look of the one on the right. Ah, the Macedonia. These are bred for battle. A true warrior's horse. I've made my choice. Which one will it be? The one on the left. Ah, uh, 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 fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. This is the one I want. Are you sure? Because yes, I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, 
F. Derby. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. Phoebe has been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimana Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Vuris, Cassandra. Hey, off we go now. I'll sneak up on them, I like it. Let me go! Suck it! Or I'll tighten those ropes! She'll make good rounds on Drachmi for the side ropes. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. Quiet, Phoebe. so I stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since... Since my parents died? I'm okay. I've got you, and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? He will be. No, not him. Take me instead. I'm tasty. Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Bake him in his bed. Yes, father. Sandra. You are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. 
lucro. too much. You don't worry enough. We'll be alright if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos the mercenary? Am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Get it! I lost the stone fist. That's just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that. Hello, Luis. Business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. Double? That's robbery. That's what I told Marcos. You know him. He's extreme. If you pay him, this will all be over with. You told Marcos I paid enough already. I won't bow to... to... to a mercenary. Or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. Malaka. Still, that doesn't change the drachma you owe. Face it. Once the Cyclops gets hold of you, you'll both be dead. The mine is yours. Just leave. Pleasure doing business with you, Ruiz. Keep my name off your lips. I don't want the Cyclops coming after me for the debt you can't pay. Until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. 
You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good. Or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back! Can't we? I'm sure it's possible. It will take a lot of work. And even then, I'm not sure. We have no option but to try! Then you'd better be willing to help. I won't do all the dirty work. <sighs> I long for the old days. <coughs> Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Cassandra! Alexios! Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh. ha. You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Think about it. Wait! Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were not- And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you! How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Talking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakis stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits. You know me. Always prepared. What did I tell you? She will leave no stone unturned. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These balls will make me rich as Christos. They're that good, are they? Wars brewing. The Athenians need good balls if they want to be part of it. Everyone benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marble? You should be tired of this small time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret spy. 
That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marco sure is lucky he's got you as his scapegoat. Any idea where these bandits are? I'm not a track rabbit warrior. They're in the mountains somewhere, that much I know. I'd check close to the lumber camps. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do. And be quick about it. I'll deal with these bandits and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. Ha! Huh. If you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. All right. I did something for you, now you do something for me. Get my wood! should probably not climb on this.
This area will be well defended. Ah! 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 Ah!
footprints. A group left this area, headed west. Shot in the back while fleeing. Must be the work of bandits. then left behind. The thief can't have gotten far with that much cargo.
Turn back. It's Marcus's mighty champion. Ah, don't tell me you actually did what I asked. I dropped the bandits and sent them to Addis. Your watch should arrive in town soon. And you expect me to believe the word of a mercenary? I didn't expect you to believe me, so I brought this. Here's your proof. A sample of the special wood you want so badly. These bows you're making had better be worthy of Apollo for all the trouble I've gone to. By the gods! You sure you work with Marcos? He's never once delivered on a promise. Incredible. I might work with him, but we're nothing alike. I'm true to my word. Then take your pay. Give none to Marcos. Sam. 
me. I wonder if we'll be able to live without getting into it. Oh, my kidding. This place never changes. I've dealt with the bandits, and caught in the woods for the boyer. I had every confidence in you, my friend. Well? Your clan? Right. The Cyclops and I have a score of track me to settle. The same score as you, my rough and tumble friend. He wouldn't be after me if it wasn't for you, my friend. <laughs> hey, right. But I swear, this will put an end to it. If he insists on sending his goons after us, We'll make sure his last good day was yesterday. Let's hear it then. What do I have to do? What will we do, you mean? As the brains to your brawn, I consider it a joint effort. Of course you do. Think, what does the Cyclops value most? His men? His land? His ships? No, his obsidian eye. Get to the point, Marcos. Oh, fine. Going to steal it. Are you crazy? You borrowed his drachme, then you steal his eye? Having it means we win. Then it goes to market. We kill two birds with one obsidian eye. <laughs> He'd better hold still, or he'll lose both eyes. No, no! It has to be done without the Cyclops knowing. You cannot be seen. Then my new bow will come in handy. He keeps the eye in his house. It's too valuable to wear out. A wise choice until you show him the error of his ways. Wait for the sun to set, sneak in, and then bring me the eye. Better be worth something. Do you know how much obsidian goes for in Kefalonia? I've never seen it. Exactly. And not only is it obsidian, it's veined with gold. Gold! It's no wonder he saves it for special occasions. So we'll use the profits to pay him off. It will pay for the bulk of it. A vineyard's expensive, you know. I don't know where the Cyclops lives. Keep to the west side of the island. There you will find his lair. Fine. But you won't get away with being cheap. Cheap? You would be Cassandra. He's your defining trait. Bring me the eye and I'll prove you wrong. Remember, not a soul can see you. Got it. Pull this off and our heads won't be the Cyclops' trophies when he comes back. Nicholas Marco says it'll be hidden.
Just the sidewalk doesn't mess around. How many of his guards were there? All for a fucking rock. This rock could buy a house, my friend. And yet, it's still not enough to pay back the cyclops. Oh, don't be upset. Think about the fun we've had. Right. Your fun, my blood. You can't keep dragging me into things, Marcos. This will work, I promise you. Would I lie to you? Don't make me answer that. Take the guy, who don't sell it yet. No vendor would believe we came by it lawfully. They know exactly who it belongs to. Fine. Better your pocket than his socket. I think that's enough for one day. Get it, Marcos. Oh, wait! I saw a boat! One I've never seen before! So? The vessel's too good for this dirty town. It must be the Cyclops. And he brought friends! He's back? Ugh. I can never catch a break, can I? Take them out, and that's one less thing to deal with. Besides, these strangers look rich as Chrysos. The Cyclops pays them well. It's win-win, my friend. It can't hurt. What do I have to lose? You? You're a winner if I ever saw one. Then where are they? In an abandoned house on the eastern coast. Who knows what golden fortunes shine in their hideout? Send them to Hades, then loot them for all they have! We'll be rich! The eastern coast... Can you be more specific? I think they've settled in an abandoned house, by a small forest south of Sami. I'm keeping some of these golden fortunes, though. No negotiations. Not even a drachme for the man who sent you? The rest goes to pay your debt. These are my terms. Oh, fine, fine. Now teach those strangers what it means to be Kefalonian. Draw blood or bleed.
You don't look so good. I angered them, I think. The gods. It's possible. I hear they can be vengeful. I used to worship Hermisa the Drogorati cave. There are gods there too, you know. In the cave? They grant wishes if you bring them tribute. So everyone makes an offering and asks for something in return. Ah, no wishes of mine granted though. I'm running out of money and tribute. I'm poor myself, you know. I did something wrong. You know, Hermes, he can be a trickster. Oh, but there are many gods in this cave, all asking for different things. Go hear them yourself. You'll get my last tribute if you do. I need to know if they're real. All right, don't worry. I'll go. Oh, thank you. Remember, be careful where you step, Mistyos. You'll be walking on holy ground. We'll see about that.
be watching for me. I need to be careful. for you and your pair should take pause. I'm listening. I'm an exile from Athens, though by looking at me, I'm sure that's impossible to believe. A successful exile, at least. We should offer enough to keep me interested. You have a good eye. What's the problem? It's my brother Ornius. He's been captured by bandits. We were attacked when our ship landed. They must have smelled our wealth from across the water. I managed to escape, but he's stuck in a cage on a dock like a beast. And you want me to rescue him? Bring him to me with not a hair on his head disturbed and I'll pay you well. I'll rescue your brother. For a price. Yes, yes, of course. Drachmi is the only language you Kefalonians understand. I'm not Kefalonian.
κεφαλόνια. Clean slaughter. Very good work. Not much sympathy for the men who work with you. Not with me. For me. Employees. Now ex-employees, I suppose. So you don't work for the Cyclops? Your kind are unusually believers of myth. Not the monster. The man. You're an outsider. Why are you here? Indeed, I'm not from Kefalonia. 
I'm here because what I'm looking for is... If you follow me, Cassandra... in the caves. Only bandits stealing people's hopes and Rahmi. <gasps> I knew it! Thieves! At least you know you won't face this is wrath. Maybe he'll take pity on you. I hope Zeus brings his wrath on those bandits. Don't worry. I brought mine. That should be good enough. And I should have known it was you to get them for me. Cassandra's always on the job. Don't tell Marcos, he'll get jealous. 
I posted, I posted it publicly to, to give the others a chance, but you're always so keen. What are the plans for this time? The Athenians want armor for the war. Good protection for them. Good Drachmi for me. Here they are. All accounted for. In record time, too. Take your pay, well earned. Stay out of trouble, Lilos. You should take your own advice. to the house of Odysseus on a tiny boat. Shall I not to be his side on our shall we?
I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. You called? Oh, Cassandra. 
You startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the Spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the Spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the Spear is in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. Kefalus for the Spear? Cassandra, surely you've heard this story since you were a child. I didn't have much time for stories. Well, perhaps you didn't. But you know Kefalus founded Kefalonia and started the line of Odysseus. His spear was a gift from the gods. It was said never to miss its target. He must have hidden it in the caves after killing his wife with it. He threw a spear that wouldn't miss at his wife? He was hunting and heard her in the bushes. He thought she was a deer. It's a sad story. Sounds dangerous. Well, only if you throw it at someone. It's hidden deep in the caves beneath Kefalonia. There's an entrance north of here. Maybe you can try that way first. That's not much to go on. You have so little faith in the gods. If Kefalus means for us to have the spear, you will find it. Why do you need the spear? Not thinking of becoming a soldier, are you? Of course not. But think how many people will come to the shrine if we have the Spear of Kefalus. With their donations, I could do so many things. Repair the sanctuary, feed the hungry families in Sami. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary. Cassandra, have you come back to talk about the Spear? I have some more questions. Of course. What do you need to know? I'll, I'll see, see what, what I can, can find. find. Oh, thank you. Cassandra? Good news, I hope. Safe and sound. Well done. And now the shroud is yours. You don't want it? After all that? I gained something more valuable today. For your troubles, Mysterious. If I knew any better, I'd think you were testing me. Perhaps. You did well, Mysterious. Tell me, how do you feel about killing a general in Megaris? Do this for me and earn double what you earned today. Are you up to the task? It would take you far away from Kefalonia. So far away you might never return. Generals bleed like anyone else. Good. What do you say? Who is this general? They call him the wolf. He'd do something to offend you? Yes, he's costing me the Rahmi. He's not good for business. Anything I should know about Megaris? Only that it's the most valuable land in the Greek world. From a military perspective, of course. Unfortunately for Megarians, it has two very powerful neighbors who just can't seem to play nice. In the tug of war between Corinth and Athens, Megaris is their own. Why me? Because no one knows who you are. You're invisible. I accept. Splendid. You need a boat. You have one, don't you? If I had a boat, we wouldn't be having this conversation. A shame. It's too far of a swim, I'm afraid. Even for you. I'll find one. Good. I hope it's sturdy. And why is that? The seas are much more dangerous, I'm afraid. 
War is coming, and the wolf is on the wrong side. And how do I know you are on the right side? Because I'm the one paying you. War? With who? The entire Greek world is at each other's throats. What rock have you been hiding under exactly? Kefalonia. You won't be disappointed. When, when your job in Megaris is done, come find me at Pilgrim's Landing in Phokis.
Cassandra, have you come back to talk about the spear? I have. Oh, good. Tell me, did you find it? Consider it a donation to the temple. What? No reward? Oh, Cassandra, I'm in your debt. If ever there's a way my temple can help you, or anyone, send them here. I will remember. It's a fine, fine ship, ship that you went. Cassandra! She is that. Ready to ride the waist for the right captain? And the right price. What will it take for you to part with her? Oh, couldn't let her go for less than 100,000. 100,000? Who has that much? Someone who's serious about buying a ship. You think a ship like this is given away? If I told you I had obsidian to trade, I'd tell you I still need 100,000 drachmi. Besides, even if I took your obsidian, a ship this size needs an army to sail it. This is Kefalonia. I could always find someone down on their luck and willing to work for next to nothing to get off this island. The seas are treacherous now. Well, more than usual. It would be suicide. Not being very helpful, Tegmenes. Not sure if this helps, but rumor has it the Cyclops is coming from you and Marcos. Rumors mean nothing. I don't believe everything you hear. Rumor also has it his ship is docked in Kleptus Bay. His ship, you say? I'll have to pay Kleptus Bay a visit. Be careful. That one eyed brute has a nasty temper. I can take his ship and deal with the Cyclops at the same time. Two birds, one stone.
Spending most of my life at sea, it would have been absolutely shameful to drown in a pot. Ah, where are my manners? I am Varnavas, captain of the Andresnia. Welcome, Varnavas. I'm pleased to meet you. And Cassandra, mistress by trade. Ha ha ha! Well, I'm sure. Oh, but you're much more than that, I'm sure. What do you mean? When they forced my head under water, I prayed to the gods, and when they pulled it out, there you were! All of Kefalonia heard your prayers. I just happened to be closest. <laughs> and you just happened to fight like Achilles, while Zeus's eagle flies around your head. Everywhere, nowhere. The Andrestia is my home. But I was born in an olive grove in Mykonos. I haven't set foot there since I left for the military. So, you're a soldier? I was. My brothers and I were captains of the Athenian fleet. Until one night during the siege, Poseidon's fury destroyed our ships. That was the night I saw it.
and I'm more fucked than everything. You're not coming, are you? If you're going, I'm going. Cephalonia is the only place you've ever known. You'd leave, leave your home? I wouldn't have been staying with you. Can't go where I'm going. I need, I need to be alone. Who's going, going to keep you company? I'll, I'll be fine. If, if I can't come, come, then take Kara. Kara? My pet eagle. She's my friend. Mother gave her to me. But she'll be your friend now. And it'll be like I'm there with you. You know? To remind you of me. Thanks, Phoebe. But, but you have to promise we'll see each other again. I promise. I promise. You, you haven't seen the last of me. Just stay out, out of trouble until then. I will. Don't, Don't worry. Okay, you, you can, can leave now. Cassandra! Leaving Cephalonia without saying goodbye to your dear Marcos? Tell me it isn't true. Well, you're here now. So it won't be true. Goodbye, Marcos. All these years as a dynamic duo! I'll never replace you! Well, I may need another assistant someday, but it won't be easy. Come now, give me a hug! All right, come here. Yes, bring it in! Oh, will I ever miss you, Cassandra? Thanks, Marcos. I'll miss you too. And what does the future hold for you? Wine, of course! Though you never know when the vines will wither. I'm always ready for another adventure. Speaking of adventure, I have a task for you, dear Phoebe. An adventure? Yes! Already following in your footsteps, isn't she, my friend? Ready to set sail? I need a bit more time on the island. I'll be back when I'm ready. I'll be waiting. Oh, 
Honor! For the life she has not! She is not spotted in the dark! Don't listen! Klaus! Don't listen! No! No! Don't listen! Nicola! Get me to Megaris. Now. But I don't understand. Of all the places under Ilios, why is our next to go there? The wolf of Sparta is my father. like a sea breeze. Does the deck always feel like it's moving? <laughs> I've got the perfect opportunity for you to get your sea legs. Oh? What would that be? Well, when the Cyclops was giving me a drumming, his pirates took my cargo. I know their ship and I know where they're heading. What say we get it back? Sure. It'll be a good opportunity to see how your ship and crew perform. Sales are held up. 